Um, yeah, so I'm going to be doing a reading for you, past, present, and future. Then I'm going to pull three cards out of the deck for your most likely outcome. I'm not going to be doing the extendants for a while. It's taking too much of my energy, and I have a lot of other things that I'm doing. So, um, you know, just letting you guys know. But if you want a personal reading, then you can schedule one on bridiestarot.com. Um, anyway, also, uh, just a little lesson. I've been telling all the signs this. But uh, it's a little hard for me to shuffle the cards today. I got a little lesson from the universe. If you don't want to hear this, noon just skip through. I really don't care. But uh, <laughs> um, I confronted somebody today. By the time you see this, it'll be yesterday, whatever. But I confronted somebody, and uh, I my gut told me not to do it. Somebody from the past, but I confronted them anyway. And uh, I ended up right after I did it, right, right after I did it, I dropped my phone in the treadmill and out of instinct went to go grab it and scraped a bunch of skin off of my fingers. So, if it's in the past, it's in the past. Leave it in the past sometimes, you know. Um, ouch, it hurts really bad. So, <laughs> um, anyway, all right, let's go ahead and do five shuffles for you, Pisces. I hope that you're well. Universe spirits and guides, please give me five shuffles for Pisces. Sorry guys. Five shuffles for Pisces, please. Universe spirits and guides, do more shuffles for Pisces, please. something good. Scorpio's reading was intense. Oh wow, okay. You got your, you're in your own overall energy Pisces not always bad your overall energy is the hangman you're you're taking a step back you're taking a step back from somebody or something because also in your present energy we have the six of swords and the eight of cups so this shows me that uh it shows me you're you're taking a step back from a situation and you're trying to see things differently here the past we have the three of coins the six of cups and the nine of coins could have been a third party. It doesn't have to be. I'm going to see this as a friendship. If it's not a friendship, then this is you coming together with somebody that you already know. This is definitely a past person. But then Nine of Coins here shows going off and being single, whether that's you or the other person, being independent, working on your independence. Like I said, present moment, Six of Swords, Eight of Cups, and the Queen of Cups. I feel like this is probably you with this Queen of Cups here. There's mutual love. There's mutual love here, but I feel like if not just you, then both parties are choosing to walk away for whatever reason. Uh, we'll have to clarify here. In the future, we have the sun, the strength, and the hierophant. A lot of happiness, a lot of joy here, but somebody's holding back on a commitment. Could be dealing with a Taurus or another water sign. I also see Leo here. Okay, so let's see what this is about. This is interesting. Universe spirits and guides, why is the hangman here? Because somebody had too many options. Why? Six of coins. I feel like somebody was impulsive in a decision. I feel like somebody was impulsive in a decision or they weren't prioritizing or there wasn't equal give and take. You could have been giving more than the other person or the other person could have been giving more um, than you were. However, someone was not prioritizing this. This was definitely, this could have been a little one-sided, you know, I almost see like scales. Um, okay, Libra, uh, I almost see like scales, like one is heavier than the other. One's putting more into one side than the other, you know what I mean? So that's what this kind of looks like to me and that's why you're taking a step back and gaining a new outlook. Um, let me see what this is here. Why is the three of coins here? 
the Knight of Swords came out. I feel like you came back together with this person at one point. And this may be, I feel like, I don't know why, but I feel like this is you with the Knight of Swords. Um, I feel like you were in, you inside, it was like, you were trying to cooperate with this person, you were trying to work together with this person, but really you had so much to say, but you held back from it. I feel like you held back from it. Feel a lot of, um, mm, mm, like stagnant energy from you. Not necessarily in a bad way, I feel like you know what you're doing. I'm getting intelligence from you. Like you have an emotional intelligence. It's like you know when to say things and when not to say things. Why is the nine of coins here for Pisces? Sorry. Ah, why? Yeah, you know, Pisces, um, I feel like this is you. This could be your person, but I feel like this is you. We have the nine coins clarified by the ace of cups and the five of cups. This is pretty simple to me. Um, I feel like, you know, this, it's like you came together with this person and like it was all good, but I feel like you decided to focus on yourself. A lot of self-love here. There's a lot of self-love here. A lot of self-love here. And I feel like there's jealousy around this. There could be jealousy around this or there could be people talking about almost like the newfound you in a way, I wanna say. I feel like people are talking about you. You know, when somebody's in this energy, you know, the nine of coins is clarified by the ace of cups. This is somebody that knows their worth. This is very, this is empress vibes, kind of queen of wands vibes. Like if you mesh them together, I feel. In a way, I mean, I know it's water and pentacles, but that's how I feel. And I feel like you got a lot of people talking. The queen of cups at the bottom, yeah. Yeah, I feel like people are talking about you, you know, or you're having an inner conflict, but I don't see it that way. I, I'm feeling a very confident energy from you, from you, or at least you're acting that way. But it's like, you know when to say things and when not to say things. You know where to put your energy and when not to put your energy. I trust this vibe, to be honest. This could be your person, the rules could be reversed. Why is the Six of Swords here? All right. So we have the Faith card, also known as the Hierophant, um, and the Queen of Cups clarifying the Six of Swords. I feel like this is you. Um, you're in a, you are really in your power here. I feel like you have gained a lot of knowledge. I feel like you were ascending as a person within yourself. I mean, we have you know the, the Faith card right next to the Queen of Cups. This is you, um, like I said, having a lot of emotional intelligence, just being intelligent, period, you know? Um, knowing where to put your energy and where not to put your energy, okay? Uh, this is fantastic. You have learned quite a bit here. You have learned quite a bit here about the situation, about life, about yourself. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Why? I feel like this is your person because you're not in this energy. This is not your, if this is your energy here, knowing where to put your energy this is not your energy because we have the eight of swords and the seven of wands clarifying the eight of cups here so it's almost like somebody's walking away because you're walking away or somebody doesn't know whether or not to walk away they're fighting in their own head they're How do I want to say it? A mental argument. I'm almost getting five of wands, um, five of wands vibes. I feel like this person's, person is telling them things that aren't really happening. 
They're doing it to themselves. They feel on defense when I don't feel like there's that much to defend. Because you're just chilling. Like, the, the Six of Swords is more like, all right, you know, cool, peace out, see you later. You know, I've learned all everything that I need to learn. I don't feel like it's choppy waters. This person, they're like, all right, well, I'm going to walk away because I know that they're doing this. I know that this is happening. Who goes there? Like, <laughs> it's catching almost like a paranoid vibe. This could very well be you, all right? Why is the Queen of Cups here? No. Why is the Queen of Cups here? King of Coins on the Page of Cups. I feel like somebody finds you incredibly alluring at this time. Very intriguing. Could be an earth sign. Could be anybody. Okay. But somebody wants to be vulnerable with you. Whether it's this person or somebody else. This is somebody that could be a businessman, businesswoman. Very stable in their power. And they have love to give. They have love to give here. Hmm. Very interesting. I don't know if it's this person though. Because I don't see whoever this is in this energy is bleh. Like a farty dirt patch. Alright, why is the sun here? Alright, I'm not taking one of those. But that hangman wanted to pop out again, so I don't know what that's about. Alright, why is the sun here, please? Why? Clarifying the sun, we have the two of wands and the fool. Somebody's going to let go of something. Uh, they're going to make the decision to let go of something and go for this. Whether that's you or somebody else. But there's a lot of happiness in whatever risk this is. I feel like this could be a newer person here. But you're walking away from somebody else because you don't, you're not messing with that energy. You're in a very self-love energy, or at least you're trying to be, or you were. But I, feel sti I still feel like you are right now. You are moving away from anybody that's not going to give you what you give. You know what I'm saying? So I like this energy here. Could be dealing with Aaliyah, but like I said, it could be anybody, all right? So the Hierophant shows up twice here. So let's see what this is. Why is the strength here though? That nine of wands showed up again. Why? Sorry, that's my cat, y'all. Um, this this energy here, I feel like it's it's either you or this person that offers you something. This is somebody fighting for this connection, but conserving their energy when need be. Fighting for what matters. Fighting for what matters. I feel like this is this other person. Could very well be you, but I feel like this person matches your energy. Whether that's friend or whatever, you know? I don't see many cups here. This is almost a friend situation, it looks like. But it could be a lover, okay? But this, this, this looks good, though. It's like they don't come on too strong. Even though we do have the strength card here, but why is the Hierophant here? Why? You know, it's, it seems like uh, we got the two of coins and we have the judgment here clarifying this hierophant. Alright, I'm just going to say it because it's in my head. But this seems like whoever this is coming back 
for round two or three or four or five, wh wh whatever it is. I feel like this is this person coming back. But it's like you're in this space, in this hierophant space, I want to say, where you've had an awakening, you know. You're getting these spiritual downloads from the universe. You're trying to be the best version of yourself. So it makes you a little indecisive, you know. So I don't know if you're going to take it. Let's see. What is the most likely outcome for Pisces, please? Got the fool two we have the fool two of wands and the devil. So I'm getting kind of two storylines here. So this person that you're walking away from, they return. They want to take a risk. They want to be in your life, but they're still holding on to whatever fears or addiction or unhealthy toxic behaviors that cause this to be dead or cause you to walk away. On the other hand, this is your new person, whoever this is, you taking a new leap of faith with them, but you still holding on to whoever this is. So, you know, it's going to be different for every Pisces. But um, Pisces, I really like this energy. I really like this energy that you're in, you know. Obviously, this isn't for every Pisces. Check your, your rising, your sun, your moon, and your Venus. But uh, this is fantastic. Okay. Real quick, I just want to see because I'm curious. What is the Six of Cups doing here? Yeah, okay. Yep. Why? Okay. This soulmate connection that you have, I think that it's with this person you're walking away from here. Uh, we got the Tower and the Four of Cups clarifying the Six of Cups. This person may be immature to you, you know. I don't feel like you are immature. I feel like this person may be a little bit. Um, I feel like there was a... Once something came together or... What is on here? Oh my god, that's just the image. Um, this this connection here, this person had a wake up call. I feel like if you rejected them or I feel like you were just bored with the situation. I want to say this person could have outbursts at times and I feel like you just weren't messing with it. So yeah, I feel like this person still has some stuff to deal with. Um, but you know, take it for what it's worth. Pisces, this is great energy. Keep doing what you're doing and uh, I love you and I'll see you later. Peace out.